I particularly don't like the screaming type, like Oda Block. Like, thank you, my ears do not need to be. I can't keep that in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't say that again, but <laughs> without getting my channel removed, <laughs> that would be nice. You wanted authentic, I gave you authentic, okay? <laughs> okay. Sure, I'm, uh, we're gonna start again. Oh, let me pull up the rules list here. Well, account sharing used to be uh, reportable, so I'll start with that. Mm -hmm. uh, seriously offensive language, um, scamming, exploiting a bug, uh, macroing or use of bots, uh, player run games of chance. So the list uh, is buying, big. selling accounts and services. Oh yeah. Since you started yeah. playing RuneScape, have you ever broken game rules? Oh yeah, I've done once, uh, and I got a temporary ban for it, and I will never do it again. <laughs> what did you do? Uh, it was real world trading. I have never been able to make money very well in this game, so I bought a bunch of money and I was able to buy a lot of like in game gear. It's made the game like 10 times more enjoyable for me, and so going through a three day temporary ban to have the actual enjoyment of having best in slack gear for everything has been really enjoyable. Oh my gosh. I am sure I have broken some sort of rule at some point. But I was one of those squeaky clean kids who never bought it, never, uh, never bought gold or anything. I was so scared that they would catch me. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No. 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 Not that I can really remember. Maybe dis uh, disruptive behavior accidentally, but I have never attempted to uh, break the game rules uh, intentionally. Yeah, probably in like 2017, I uh, I would gamble within my clan, and then over time of gambling within the clan and just doing the things in the clan, it kind of like bled into like paying for stuff on Discord and then it being trading and game, and so it did end up being a bit of uh, RWT. But you know, that really killed the game for me, and so I've since made this account and this account. I haven't. We've been, we've been a good boy, and I really enjoy the game a lot more. Back many years ago, in like around 2009, 2010, so back on the main game, I did do some botting to get from like at level 83 to 87 wood cutting. Yes. What was it? Um, it was botting. Uh, did you get caught? Yes. You, so you did get banished? Yes. Yeah, that account is permabanned. Oh, okay, okay. Do you regret it now? Uh, not really. I didn't, I didn't think too much of it. Okay. Um, yeah, it was ages ago when I was in primary school and, you know, I had my first RuneScape account mm -hmm. and all my friends were doing it. And I see. yeah, it was, it was just a normal thing. It wasn't like how people do it now, you know, where they have a hundred accounts and they sell stuff and stuff, you know, it's... I mean, other than my, my cool stands, uh, I don't think so. Uh, yes, a hundred percent. What did um, you break? On more than one occasion. RWT rules, buying gold staking since the jewel arena has been out just due to the addictiveness of staking mm -hmm. here's a follow-up yeah, question to that uh probably yeah. not gonna be in the video but are you glad that the dwell arena is removed now yes i am glad it's removed however i don't think it's neglected people away from staking dueling gambling of any sorts in the game i mean people still do it in clan competitions between friendship groups is still very prominent. Yes, I, I buy a lot of gold, probably like 30, 40 bill worth of gold. I can show you my duels. Do you buy it uh, right now or like like recently or have you done it in the past? Uh, since the duel arena has disappeared, I've actually kind of stopped buying gold and I, I now play uh, Iron Man. Okay, I have a follow up question. Would you say that yeah. after you stopped buying gold and started playing Iron Man, do you enjoy the game more? Yeah, far more. Like uh, what I used to do was just buy a few billion gold and then just stake it all and then get like really high numbers of gold on my account. Like I have placeholders for all the end game gear and like it was crazy, but like I wouldn't ever do any content because I'd just be like, yeah, I, I make like hundreds of mils an hour in my real job and like staking is way more GP per hour than actually doing any content. So let me just keep doing staking. Mm -hmm. It's it's really stupid. And now with my Iron Man, I'm like, whoa, I made 200k per hour, bro. 
No, no, not really. Uh, not really, I don't think. Uh, no, I have not. No, I don't think I have. If you count the S being muted, yeah, sure, I've broken some rules. I think back in 2008, uh, I bought GP. Um, How much did you buy? I think I bought like 25 mil mm -hmm. with my mom's credit card. So. Nice. Well, to be honest, when I first started playing back in the day, when I was really young, I was really into luring and scamming people. Mm -hmm. But uh, ever since I started playing like, as an adult, I haven't broken any rules. Not on old school RuneScape, but I did used to I did used to gamble as a, uh, a ten year old kid uh, on RuneScape Two. Definitely hosted some flower games in my time for sure. I don't think so. I've certainly broken a bunch of rules on a, when I played originally. I engaged in as a as a sort of 13, 14 year old some pretty some stuff I would say I'm not especially proud of back before it was before old school even existed. I was part of a group of people who it was just basically gankers out in the wilderness. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't P PK anymore, and but yeah, I definitely uh, was pretty rude and found my way around the chat filter back when that was a thing. Uh, yes, many, many times. Uh, this is actually like my sixth main. I've been permabanned on five accounts before. You have been permabanned on five accounts and this is your sixth one? Yes. Mm -hmm. What were you permabanned for? I was permabanned for botting. Oh, okay. Uh, do you regret it? No, not at all. <laughs> mm -hmm. I have not. I have considered it uh, here and there because, you know, especially for GP, because I wanted to accelerate my account, but I still want to experience all the content there is, but I kind of just want to be able to do it faster. So I've bought some bonds just to help like get base gear to be able to like start doing harder quests faster and actually fight some boss monsters faster. Mm -hmm. And it, I've always been like annoyed about the fact that like, there's basically no punishment for uh, buying GP, you know, like up until recently, you know, for like the past 10 years, they basically did nothing about it. I, I know recently they've started uh, like actually banning people who real world traded. Yeah. But up and before that, they really didn't. And I always kind of got upset because like, you know, somebody else is spending like $10 for like 30 mil. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, like to get 30 mil worth of bonds, you're spending like 40, 50 bucks. Mm -hmm. So I used an auto clicker to mine within like a week of having my account because I didn't really understand that that was like against the rules or like what the risks were. But it wasn't, I think it was not even for an hour before I was like, I want to go back to actually playing. And so I quit doing that. But other than that, I haven't done any of the, I, I, don't, there, I don't think I've actually broken any of the rules, like account sharing or anything of, like that. I'm pretty sure I've broken a couple of rules, intentionally yeah. or not. What were they, if you don't mind saying? I'm not going to say much, but there have been a few with Neve and spicy content okay. that Jackie Baggy doesn't like. Okay, I see, I see, I see. No, I don't think so. No, actually, I don't think I have. I don't think so, no. No, never. Mm, no, no, I haven't. No, I've uh, I've always been, because I played RuneScape when I was really young, back in the day, I was always terrified that uh, a mod was going to catch me doing something, so uh, I don't. I can honestly say I don't think I've actually broken any rules ever. Uh, when I first started within the first month, I bought GP, but not since that. It was only like twenty dollars worth, or yeah. So it was like I bought twenty mil, and since then I haven't done anything more game breaking. Uh, yes. What was it? But uh, like I set up an auto clicker macro on my with my like uh gaming mouse software to alk things while I was a uh, while I just cooked dinner or something. How long time ago was it? Oh, that was like a year and a half ago. Mm -hmm. Did you get punished? Uh, no. Nope. Never? Nope, not that I know of. Okay. <laughs> they gave me paranoid that I have, but no, I don't think I have. There there aren't really any rules on there I feel are worth breaking. Mm -hmm. Um, I have. <laughs> I was once a botter at some point, like I botted fishing on my account just because I had that one chance to break the rules. Because they give you two chances and you're out sort of thing. So I was just like, you know what, I've got one opportunity just to break the rules. I'm just going to do some fishing. Yes. 
Yes, I have. Um, do you consider uh, account sharing as breaking rules? Uh, according to Chegex, it's a gray area, so I probably not. Okay, I, this is a muddy answer, and I, this, I'm glad this is anonymous. So, on my computer, when I was, this was 2007, uh, my buddy, he downloaded a bot program, and he bought it on there, and I did not stop this, and he used my account. So, inadvertently, I bought it, and that, that account's been banned. And mm -hmm. uh, every account that was associated with, with, with it was banned, but I guess I was a botter. Uh, yes, I have. You want to talk about it? Uh, it? Sure. My original first account I ever made before this one, I bought it. I don't know. I think I bought it to like 80 combat stats. And then um, I actually started doing a, a woodcutting bot. I think I'd, I think it was for like Lost City or something. You needed like a woodcutting requirement, which was only like 30 or something. And I'm like, I'm just going to bot this. And then I got banned on that. Um, and also when I made this account at first, I have bought some gold. Oh, yeah. Back when um, it first started, I did. Um, I broke down and I got a bot and did the ranging guild and that account got banned in probably a matter of a few weeks. Mm -hmm. Do you regret it? Oh, for sure. This is actually the account that got banned. Oh, and since then you've been clean? Yep, it's been clean since. Okay, okay, okay. Perfect, perfect. I like it. Yes. Okay, what was it? Do you want to talk about it? No. <laughs> I see, I see. Okay. Next question. I mean, we all have it some, at some point, surely. Mm -hmm. Was it like, let's say, was it when you were a kid or was it like recently? Um, When I was a kid and recently as well. I see, okay. Question number three. Say again? Is that judgment out here? Uh, trust me, I always judge you, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh. <laughs>